why is someone calling my phone when I'm recording? So as a content creator, one way when you're recording a video to avoid distraction, I record my videos using a phone by the way, for those of you who don't know. One way of not distracting yourself when you're recording your content, put your phone on the airplane mode. No one is going to disturb you. another video i feel like i did not introduce myself in the previous video for the new mem members who have recently joined us my name is eva a content creator currently based in the eastern part of kenya so welcome in welcome aboard i just realized the other day that we are almost getting to two months without me posting a video in this channel and i was like no even if i am doing what i have to create time and at least catch up with my champions see what they are doing you know we have a very beautiful relationship that we have cultivated in in here which i cannot take for granted which i cannot ignore so thank you guys for the support you've been showing me if you haven't subscribed subscribed please do consider joining us I promise you that you're going to love it in here adulting comes with its own challenges so that's what I've been working on, just handling one thing at a time. I'm at a stage where I just want everything to fall in place without me putting in so much pressure. So I take my time, take my time before I make decisions, I do my research these days. Uh, I don't want to say that I'm overthinking. But I'm just trying to make decisions like in a sober state. Yes. So yeah, I am back guys. Ah, this thing is finished. Which means now I have to go and shop for more. Because I'm not planning to, to unbraid this hair this weekend. It will have to wait until next weekend. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to get another spray. Then uh... I just play around styling the hair for the next uh, five six days then uh, when we get to Saturday you're going to remove this hair but oh my goodness these knotless braids have been knotling on this head like I really love them the person who did them did an amazing job oh I charged some good money but I'm not complaining at least I've seen the value for money. I've been enjoying this hair. You see how they are neatly done. They are even. The size is the same. You know, when you do something, give it your best. Like I have this saying, I don't know where I got it from, but it goes like this like, whatever you are, be a good one. If you are a preacher, be a good one. If you are a mother, be a good one. If you are a content creator, be a good one. That's what I'm trying to become, a good content creator. So that's what's up, right? So right now I want to step out to go to the local market and uh, shop for some groceries because I've realized that shopping in the retail shops nearby is a waste of money. Like if you want to save some money, one money saving tip. Just go to the local market and shop there. The prices are a bit friendly. The quantity is also better compared to the one in the retail shops. And also, you can bargain and get an extra tomato, an extra onion, an extra carrot. And you know, that extra carrot, that extra onion, that extra tomato is going to serve you for an extra day. So... Don't underestimate the power of an extra potato, extra onion, extra carrot. Never said that I didn't tell you. So these days I'm into bulk shopping. Like I just go to the local market. I shop for potatoes. I shop for uh, nyanyas, that is tomatoes. I shop for carrots. Anything which can be shopped at the local market, I will do it. I think my first stopover will be 
a place where I'm going to purchase some braids because I I have two two packs of braids. I need an extra two or three. Then um this spray I need to buy another spray. Then uh, what else? Just that. Then uh we go straight to the market. <sighs> The last time I was here, the prices were a bit high with some shillings. I hope today they have a good offer because with this inflation, everything is, is expensive. Oh. oh, 55 shillings. It's a good deal. someone's phone because some people don't have like the pay bill numbers still numbers uh, so when you pay in cash it will save you some coins i hope you also do that if you don't do it then you can borrow that tip from myself and other people who do it so yeah and you also need a shopping list when you go to the market that you, like you can't just go shopping aimlessly you need to to draw a budget and stick to it if you want to keep track of your finances because these days managing money is a skill managing money is a skill one moment you will have this amount of money the next minute you have nothing you're borrowed who wants to be who wants to be a slave of debt i mean this is 2022 everyone is trying to come out of debt myself included so shopping in bulk has really helped me save money it's one of that secret that i was overlooking of course i knew that when you go to the local market the deal is better than when you shop from the supermarket or from the retail shops around 